All right, we've got the 2009 Andrew Murray Central Coast Syrah. And let me tell you, this wine really is a rock star wine like Andrew Murray's <laughs> reputation is, isn't it? He's making me a groupie, I'll tell you that. One smell of this, and you know you've got super quality wine. Why? Why am I saying that? Well, it's the espresso. There is a mm. wonderful dark berry and espresso in here right on the nose, you know, oh, right away. You're getting really complex good. fruit flavors. Mm. And for a $15 wine, this is 15 bucks first of all. Yeah, that's good. And let me tell you, it really brings it to me. It Let's does. get into it. It, it ignites a passion for me because this is what fine wine is all about in my book. What is it? It's this well-integrated oak. There's boysenberry, there's cedar, there's some chocolate in here. But what it really is, is a very, very balanced wine. This yes. wine defines balance yes. for me. Yeah, I really like that there's a sweet oak taste in this wine that really drives me mm, over the, I'm going over the edge. It's also a fresh tasting wine. Oh, this wine really is not is. old and stale. It's fresh yeah. and lively and the fruit is forward and, and there and it's all in balance, just like Joe said. And then, at the end of the day, it's not a $15 wine. No. We peg the value at this wine. I think it's worth $25 all day long. Yeah, I don't just think it, I know it. Matt and I recently have sampled hundreds of Shirazes, and I would tell you right now, if you picked a whole bunch of $25 bottles, this would come out right at the top. There's an argument to be made here that this wine is closer to $35 or even $40 yeah. because of its exceptional balance and quality. Try a bottle for yourself, see where you peg the value, but I'll bet you you come out in the high wine category, maybe probably higher than 25 bucks. Well, you know, we're we're safe one more that. thing, yeah, Joe, and yeah. that is this really truly has a, an artisan small batch yes, taste yes. to it, and for $15 that you can find in your grocery store, that's what's so incredible about this Syrah. It's just really <laughs> well, has Well, you know, you reminded together. me there is one more thing. There's one more thing on top of that, one more thing. This is re actually really important, and it's interesting. These guys do a lot of night harvesting of grapes, and people, if you never, if you didn't even know that, a lot of a lot of people are swear by harvesting grapes at night, and I think you can tell with this wine because there's a balance in in here that is really exceptional. People harvest at night because they say the the, the sugars are lower. It leads to a more flavorful kind of balanced grape, and that's what's yes. in here. Derek should throw up some yes. video of their night harvest because I know they got some, and it's just a fascinating kind of piece of the story. Workers are certainly happier. It's yeah. a lot cooler at night. Why not? No, I actually think it comes through because this fruit is really, yeah. really uh, flavorful. It's yeah. really, it's all there. So, um, hey, it's two thumbs up to the 2009 Angie Murray Central Coast Syrah. <laughs> Tour le jour Syrah. It means every day in French. Yes, every day. It's like they have a different word for it.